Hi everyone, my name is Ashley Dunn and I'm your independent Norwex consultant. Today I'm going to do a little experiment on how hand sanitizer compares to just Norwex and water on removing bacteria from our hands. And so for this demonstration, I'm going to use something called glow germ powder. This stuff represents bacteria and it glows in the dark. So you're going to be able to see what's left on our hands um, in both cases. So first, I'm going to take a little bit of the glow germ powder, sprinkle it in my hand, then I'm going to rub my hands together just like this. You can turn off the light and we'll see what's on my hands here. This is a black light. It's going to show. Okay, so you can see my hands are covered in this powder. So think about that like dirt or germs. So I'm going to take the hand sanitizer, which often in classrooms we use right before someone goes to lunch and just have them rub it on their hands. And the, the idea behind it is that it's supposed to kill the bacteria. So here we go. We're, we need to kind of let it dry and then it takes a hot second, doesn't it, right? And it can burn, obviously, especially with little kids. They don't quite understand why it burns, but it's the alcohol. And so they're still a little bit wet, but we're, st we're gonna be able to see what's left behind on our hands. So go ahead. Okay, so it's still there. Whatever gunk was there, it's still there. It might be dead. We don't really know for sure, but whatever it was on our hands, it's still there. Now, what we're gonna do is we're gonna take Norwex microfiber in just water, and I'm going to use this to clean off my hands as good as I can here. Might not be perfect, but I will tell you that I've been using Norwex and water in my home for a long time. We don't use hand sanitizer. We don't use chemicals to clean our surface. We literally use Norwex and water. And this is what I feel comfortable giving my kids in a travel cloth to take to school to wash their hands before lunchtime and um, any other time they would need to. So, um, can I have that black light please? Okay, so now you can see just how much better it is with just water and an Enviro cloth. So, what I recommend for classrooms is that instead of wipes every year, that people could just ask for a, a $5 donation instead of asking for wipes and every child can have their own personal travel enviro cloth. And I'm actually live in the kindergarten classroom because I wanna show you how cool uh, of a setup this can be in a classroom. So I'm just gonna take this right here and walk you around and show you how each student can have their own travel enviro cloth that they can get wet at the beginning of the day, have their name on, and it can dry throughout the day, letting the silver break down the bacteria. And as they need to, they can wipe their hands on it instead of having to use hand sanitizer. This can also be used on desks the same way. So I hope that's helpful for you, especially you teachers. And I will be coming out with some more videos to show you just how you can Norwax your classroom.